Houston, Texas, a night to remember. The city lights shimmered like a thousand stars, setting the stage for an unforgettable event. Beyonce, the queen herself, joined forces with Vice President Kamala Harris, two powerful women, icons in their own right, standing together for a cause that affects millions. Their mission? to fight for reproductive rights, to ensure that every woman has the freedom to make choices about her own body. Thousands gathered, their voices united, people from all walks of life coming together with a shared purpose. This wasn't just a rally, it was a movement, a powerful demonstration of solidarity and strength. It was a call to action. The energy was electric, hope filled the air. You could feel the determination and passion in every cheer and every chant. Stories were shared, tears were shed, and voices rose in unison. Personal experiences that highlighted the importance of the cause, touching the hearts of everyone present. This was a night about our bodies, our choices, our futures. A night to stand up and be heard, to demand respect and autonomy. And the message was clear, we will not be silenced. Together, we are stronger. Together, we will fight for our rights and for the rights of future generations. The crowd stretched as far as the eye could see. Men and women, young and old, stood shoulder to shoulder. They came from all walks of life, united by a single cause. Signs held high, voices strong. They chanted in unison. My body, my choice. Their energy was contagious, their message undeniable. This was a movement, a force to be reckoned with. Vice President Harris took the stage with grace and determination. Her words resonated through the crowd. She spoke about the progress made and the rights we cannot afford to lose. This is not a drill, she emphasized. The future of our nation, our freedoms, hangs in the balance. This election will determine the fate of reproductive rights for generations to come. Then Beyonce graced the stage. The crowd erupted. A hush fell as she began to speak, her voice filled with passion and purpose. She spoke about love, equality, and the fundamental right to choose. Her words were a rallying cry. We will not go back, she declared. We deserve the right to make decisions about our own bodies. We deserve freedom. The crowd roared in approval. Section 5. Texans speak out. Personal stories, shared struggles. But it wasn't just Beyonce and Vice President Harris who shared their truths. Everyday Texans, their voices filled with emotion, took to the stage. They shared their stories, their struggles, and their fears. Women whose lives had been forever changed by Texas's abortion laws. Women who had been denied essential health care. Their stories were heartbreaking, their resilience inspiring. Their voices mattered. Section 6, every vote counts. The stakes have never been higher. In this critical moment, the energy is palpable. The air is thick with anticipation and hope as people from all walks of life gather to make their voices heard. Vice President Harris returned to the stage, her voice resolute. She stood tall, embodying the spirit of determination and resilience. Her presence alone was enough to ignite a spark of hope in the hearts of many. She reminded the crowd of the power they held in their hands, the power to vote, the power to shape the future of their communities, their states and their country. It was a call to action, a reminder that democracy thrives when every citizen participates. The power to make a difference, the power to stand up for what is right, to challenge the status quo and to demand change. The crowd erupted in cheers, united in their shared purpose and determination. This election is about our rights, our freedoms, our future, she declared. Every vote matters, every voice counts. Her words resonated deeply, echoing the sentiments of a nation on the brink of transformation. The Senate race is tight, the stakes couldn't be higher. The outcome of this election will shape the direction of the country for years to come. The energy in the room was electric, a testament to the importance of this moment in history. Section seven. Our voices, our votes, a call to action. The rally concluded with a powerful call to action. Register to vote, make a plan, talk to your friends and family, spread the word. This wasn't just a night of speeches and music. It was a call to arms, a call to fight for what we believe in, a call to protect our rights. Section 8. United for Change. The fight for reproductive rights continues. 
In cities and towns across the nation, people are coming together to demand justice and equality. The streets are filled with passionate voices, each one a testament to the collective strength of those who refuse to be silenced. As the night drew to a close, one thing was clear. The fight for reproductive rights is far from over. The flickering candles symbolized hope and resilience, a reminder that even in the darkest times, the light of justice can shine through. But with every voice raised, every story shared, and every vote cast, we are making a difference. Each person who steps up to the microphone, each individual who shares their personal journey, adds to the growing chorus demanding change. We move closer to a future where all people have the freedom to make choices about their own bodies. This is not just a fight for reproductive rights. It is a fight for human dignity, for the right to live without fear or oppression. This rally was a testament to the power of unity, showing that when we come together, we can achieve great things. The energy in the air was palpable, a collective heartbeat of determination and hope. The importance of using our voices cannot be overstated. Every chant, every slogan, every word spoken into a microphone is a declaration of our commitment to justice. It is a call to action urging others to join the movement. And the unwavering spirit of those who believe in a more just and equitable future for all is inspiring. The diversity of the crowd, people from all walks of life standing together, is a powerful reminder that this fight affects everyone. We will not be silenced. These words echoed through the streets, a powerful mantra that united everyone present. It was a promise, a vow to continue the struggle no matter the obstacles. We will not back down. The determination in their eyes, the strength in their voices, all pointed to one undeniable truth. This fight is far from over. Together, we will continue to push forward, to demand our rights, and to ensure that future generations inherit a world where justice prevails.